Hey guys, it's Wayne here. Today's video is going to be a Draw With Me video and a cheap stationary mini haul. If you want to jump straight to the Draw With Me bit, you can click on the timestamp in the description below. I saw some cheap stationery at a Japanese store here in KL called Ubiso. I think most of you are familiar with the well-known Japanese dollar store called Daiso. So yeah, Ubiso is similar to that. This is my mini haul. It all came out to about 20 ringgit which is approximately equivalent to a little under 5 American dollars. They had 3 for 5 ringgit deals so you know I had to get the pens in sets of 3s. Dirt cheap! The first item is a set of 36 water-based coloured pens. It says that it's washable, so I suppose these are kid-friendly pens. Um, they kind of remind me of the Stabilo ones. I mainly bought them because the cute packaging caught my eye. Next are the markers. They had about 150 to 200 colours, but I picked my usual six. They all have English names instead of Japanese ones, so that's useful. Since they are dual markers, they come in both fine and broad nibs, so that's a plus point. Lastly are these ordinary gel pens for writing. I'm usually a 0.7mm girl, but they only had 0.5mm, so I bought them anyways since I should probably stop using my fancy microns to write notes. Let's begin. I prepared a rough sketch before the video, so I'm going to use that. Usually I will rub off some of the pencil marks before using the markers just to have as minimal pencil marks as possible. I usually draw the outlines first and then colour them in as an indication so I won't accidentally make any mistakes. I use the broad end for larger parts so I can cover more surface area in a shorter time. Next is my favourite step, inking. Here I'm using the Pentel Color Brush Pen. It's one of my favourite brush pens for inking because the nib is firm and flexible enough to give me a good range of line variation. Then, I use the water-based pens for the flannel patterns. And the gel ink pens for the detailing. Overall, I think for the price I paid, these random cheap pens were pretty decent and probably were better than I expected them to be. If you're looking to just doodle for fun, you can always practice on cheap stationery and save your good stuff for your actual work. Well, thanks for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more videos. All my links will be down below in the description and I'll see you guys online. Bye!